How's the hang of 2K heads? This is 2K King Slayer back again with another NBA 2K18 freelance tutorial. Today we are going to be talking about the Swing Freelance slash Hornets Freelance. They're they're the same thing, guys. They're basically the same thing. Uh, so before we get into it, please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. My goal, as always, is to promote sim gameplay within the online community. So if that's something you support, hit like and subscribe. So, if you guys were like me during the 2000s and the early 2010s, you were probably wondering, what was that pretty classic offense that the Spurs used to run, and is it in 2K? I always used to wonder that, and the answer is that, yes, it has been in 2K for a while, and you can run it and make really pretty plays like the one that I'm about to show you. This is one of the prettiest plays that I've ever run. Check this out. And one. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how I pulled that off and how you run this offense. So first and foremost, to set up your freelance, you're gonna press left on the D-pad. You can scroll through your menu using R2 and L2. You then select the icon of the freelance that you wanna run, and then you move to a trigger point, which will vary based on the freelance, and I'm gonna show you the main trigger points today. So, let's get into it. Uh, one of the first trigger points is on one of the wings there. You can see here that we're going to swing the ball from side to side until Campbell Walker comes around and knocks down an open three. So to slow that down real quick, you start off on one of the wings. Kemba comes off two picks there and knocks down an open one. Now you're not always going to be open once you come off of those two picks. So here's what you can do. If you're not open, like here, you're going to receive a pick and go around and take it to the basket. So again, in that case, the two picks are going to be there, but your defender might catch up with you. So in that case, you just take the following pick and you can take it to the basket. Okay, and then you can also trigger this from the corner. So you can see if you get it into the corner, a lot of times you'll get that split cut action and you'll find a man wide open right underneath the basket and that's the easiest bucket in 2k right there so those are the three main trigger points but let's jump into a game um, actually using the Raptors here and we're gonna swing the ball from side to side balance Eunice comes off we're not gonna take a three with him but we managed to get inside kick it out to CJ Miles and that one was a little ugly he was kind of contested so let's run that back again see if we can't get a cleaner run of this play so again we start in the corner I'm gonna swing to the other side DeMar DeRozan oh my goodness that's nasty DeMar DeRozan throwing it down and you're going to manage to get a lot of those driving lanes using this offense. This time they double team, but they didn't realize Kyle Lowry was going to come off of those double screens, I guess. All right, it, he actually, it was just a little brush screen from Valenciunas, not even a true screen there, but we move on. We're up 11-4 here in the first. Double screens here. Powell doesn't have the shot, so again, he takes... That pick there, we swing it to the other side, and when you swing it to the other side after those actions, you're going to get baseline every single time. So again, you can see that baseline is wide open. Steven Adams has to slide over, but when he does, it's too late. We're already there with Fred Vlan Vlan Vleet. I can't speak today. I apologize. Okay, so 427 left in the second. We are up by nine now. We continue to swing. And Norman Powell takes it inside using the swing freelance offense. So this is a really fluid freelance as you guys could see. We take it inside again and this is the play that I showed you guys at the beginning of the video. One of my favorite plays that I've ever run before. And we score with Pirtle. And I mean... Honestly, guys, like, look at this. Look at all these passes. I'm not going to count them up. You can count them if you want, but so pretty. Guys always seem to be moving into the right spots in this freelance, which is why I like it so much. 
It's really intuitive, really easy to learn, but it's not so simple that, you know, that your opponent is gonna figure it out right off the bat. Now watch what happens here. You guys are gonna see that I'm gonna drag the defenders towards the middle because I know that CJ Miles is coming off of that screen and he ends up with a wide open shot. So that's one of those things where the arrows doesn't tell you to do that, but you're gonna use your basketball IQ to make moves like that. Thinking about where your opponents are gonna be, use some misdirection. That time, Kyle Lowry manages to knock down the jumper from the middle, and my friend is gonna quit. So guys, we got a rage quit out of this one. If you appreciated this video, if this helps, please leave me a comment, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. We'll be back soon. Happy gaming, y'all.